guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, grocery hauls, recipes, and what's for dinner. And I am here today with a quick Kroger haul. I had to run in and get just a few items, or so I thought, and I ended up spending a little over $74 but I think I got some pretty good deals, so I just wanted to share them with you. So we'll start right over here with the produce. The grapes were 99 cents a pound, so I grabbed a bag of grapes. And then they had their cheese on sale, the Kroger brand, either by the block or shredded, and so I decided to get some blocks of cheese. So I got two Monterey Jack, one Colby Jack, and two Swiss. I plan on making a recipe that my mom used to make when I was growing up with the Monterey Jack cheese, so be on the lookout for that. And then I, um, I plan on making some quiche with the Swiss cheese. We are having taco salads tonight, so I needed a bag of shredded lettuce, and Howard loves avocado, so I got him two avocado for the taco salad. I don't really care for avocado at all, so I definitely won't be eating that. And Kroger had a sale on their shrimp, and this is raw tail off. It's been deveined and peeled white shrimp. They are, sorry, here it is. They are two pound bags, and these were $4.77 a pound. So I thought that was a great deal. I got two bags, and then I happen to like this brand of Kroger shrimp right here. And I had a coupon that they sent me in the mail for $2.35 off. And this bag before coupon was uh, $8.99. So I grabbed a bag. I needed some beef for the taco salad. Now I do have, talk, um, I do have ground beef in the freezer, but I didn't think it would be thawed and ready by the time I needed to use it. So I just grabbed a pound of the ground beef. And then the Eckridge sausage was part of a buy five, get a deal. So, um, and it was not just necessarily five of the sausage, five of the any participating products, and I'll show you the other two products that I got. So these ended up being $1.99 a package. So I got one beef and two, just the like the pork blend sausage. And you guys know that Howard and I love this jerk shrimp from Margaritaville. Now, normally I only get their shrimp when it's on sale, buy one, get one free, but I wanted some, so I grabbed a box of the jerk shrimp. And then I have never seen this Sunset Shrimp Scampi before, so I decided to give that a try. Another five, uh, another one of the products that you could get um, that you had to get five of in order to get a deal was the ice cream. So I got a little pint of Rocky Road ice cream to round off the five items that I needed to get the deal on the sausage. So I got the Rocky Road ice cream, which came up to $2.99. And then I also got a box of the um, butter, Land O'Lakes. So normally I just buy unsalted butter for baking but Howard requested salted butter for just spreading on like toast and things like that. So um, I got the butter, the ice cream, and the sausage. Um, the, those are the five items that I needed in order to get a deal on those five items. So I got that. And then they had a really good deal on Pillsbury products. Pillsbury products were buy one, get one free. And so um, I found a couple of new products from Pillsbury that I had not seen before. One of them are these filled crescent rolls with apple. Now I don't really care for apple products like um, apple pie, but Howard does. So I got these for him, apple filled crescents. And then I've never seen these either. They say that they're new. These are chocolate chip sweet biscuits with icing. And that sounded really good to me. I got a um, roll of crescent rolls just because I like to keep those on hand. And the other new product that I picked up were these um, paste, excuse me, place and bake brownies with peanut butter cups. They also had them without the peanut butter cups. 
but you're supposed to bake them in a cupcake tin. So those really looked good to me too and I just wanted to give them a try. So anyway, this is what I got. Like I said, it was just a few things that I picked up from Kroger. I really wasn't there to go grocery shopping. I just wanted to grab a few things. And like I said, $74 later, this is everything that I picked up. So anyway, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, I certainly hope you'll do so. See you guys next time.